Hello and welcome to a little zoo. So I'm coming on today because I did a swap with Kay who is Kazikin's one here on YouTube and this is what she has sent me back. Now you will have seen my video yesterday on what I made her. If you're not already subscribed to Kay's channel please go over and subscribe to her. Um, and let's see what she's sent. So I did open up the card. So this is actually a tent fold card, which is really, really nice. Um, so she's put Velcro dots and she explained to me on the email that you attach both the Velcro dots and it makes this shape. Uh, I think she said that she was inspired by Wooly Steph. Um, I'll just check it. Yeah, Wooly Steph. There's a fab tutorial on the TP card. So I'll, I'm going to go and have a look at this myself because this looks really, really nice. Just stands up like that. Love the card. Thank you so much, Kay. I'm actually inspired to try this myself, so I'm quite excited. So this is a sort of ephemera folder journal type thing that we agreed to swap. Now, you'll have known that mine ended up being a die-cut book instead of an ephemera book, which I hope is okay. I'm trying to save the little rosette because it's so cute. Oh. I'll glue that back on later. Oh, there we go. So she's made this beautiful little rosette in blue. The cage wrapped hers up absolutely beautifully and I didn't <laughs> I didn't even think to wrap mine up. So mine's went off in one of those Amazon bo book boxes and had to fold it differently so that it would hold my folder in it. I mean, look at this washi. I don't have any washi like this. This is really nice. Wow. So to start off with we have this little charm, little paper clip charm that she's made and she's got some beautiful beads on here. She rolled paper on some wire attached it to a paper clip and then she's added I think that's corrugated card she's used as well there's a little heart and a pearl that's beautiful thank you so this is for inspiration I love her border punch that is so so nice I really like how it's quite big as well. So, inside here, she's made a couple of little different things. 
So we've got one of these folds. Oh, it's a little notebook. And if I'm remembering correctly, I think this was G who made this using one of our free digital papers. This isn't our digital paper. In case you use something different. But that's what it reminds me of. Thank you so, so much. I love the opening on this. It's quite easy. And it looks really nice as well. You'll need to let me know if I'm right, if it was G, who you got the inspiration from. Because I do, I'm sure it was G and I'm sure it was part of a free digitals that she made one of these with. And then she's got, well, she's got these little word and phrases that I actually bought off her Etsy shop. And she did use one of them on it and it looks something like these as well. And they're nice. That one says courage. Is he and then she's made... <sighs> Look at this ATC. That is gorgeous. So she's beaded a handle on it. That is so nice. I'm going to hang this up actually. I'm not sure what you've done. That looks sort of like a napkin. And then you've used gold around the edging and a few Tim Holtz bits. They are so nice. Thank you so, so much for this. That is beautiful. <sighs> She's made me a tag as well. <laughs> Now, I'm always confused on how people do the tags and add so much to them. So, like when you see Tracy um, do hers, it's a fox, Tracy Fox. She puts layers and layers and layers on. So does Shabby Dabby Duda and Artie Mays. They like layer up everything. And I struggle a lot with my layering. Especially when it goes into like multiple layers. Then we have... <sighs> wow. So this is the... Is it Trifold Pocket? I think I've seen the video for this. This is, well, it's trifle pocket ticket because it looks like a big giant ticket. Love the boat applique and she's used a little rose. And then she's got this beautiful trim here and each, so we've got believe in yourself. Hope is never lost. And go with your heart. These are absolutely beautiful. I love that it's like a little set here. Just using different words. Thank you for these. This has given me a lot of inspiration as well. You might see some of these ideas popping up in my Christmas selection. Oh, look, she's put the bows and the roses on all of them. Thank you so much for these, Kay. And then the last one here, she's got beautiful butterfly stamp on either side. We have Oh, 
I'm trying not to knot it because knowing me I'd probably knot it. So she's added the baker's twine to either side of it. Oh, look at that. That is beautiful. And then we've got little tags, little circle tag in this pocket here. These are so cute. <laughs> And then a nice big tag right there. Thank you so, so much for this, Kay. This is giving me a lot of inspiration. I really, really like this one here. Thank you. They're really, really nice. Thank you so much for these, Kay. Absolutely beautiful. So we've got something to make. Oh, surprise. I'll open that up last. And then... Look at this. This is beautiful. I love the pastel colours of the rosettes here. Oh. I think this is just falling out. Oh, maybe that's where this one fell out from. So. She's used a beautiful pastel pink ribbon to tie it up. I tied mine up with organza ribbon. Oh, wow. This is absolutely gorgeous. Wow. This is beautiful, Kay. Yeah, there's where they came from. So, she's made all these beautiful altered paper clips going all the way along this bottom pocket so we've got these three the beautiful beads on the bottom then we've got four of these And these are beautiful. And I really like the fact that instead of just putting like a wee scrap of paper on the back, she's actually used the full die to give it a back in as well. And then she's added the smaller one and then layered flowers onto them. Look at this one. Now, I remember Kay showing. So, i seen her showing the stamp and rosé. I don't think these are the same pa altered paper clips that she's showed, though. These are beautiful. That one's attached to a little tag. <laughs> and then, now, one of the things that I'm suggested using was laces, ribbons, trims, embellishments, all that types of things to put into the folders to give ideas of what we could put in. And she's used this big spool and she's attached this gorgeous lace 
that is beautiful. <laughs> and in this one, she's used two big spools and she's attached this blue organza ribbon and it's got little blue lines going through it. We've got this orangey organza ribbon. This will be perfect for Halloween, this one. That's lovely. And then she's also put on this beautiful little lace. I just pulled it out. It feels very delicate as well. And I'm not sure if it's making up, but it's got tiny, tiny little flowers going all the way along the centre in a wavy pattern. That's beautiful. And then she's gifted me some of this peach. There we go. So we've got this beautiful peach. And then on this one, I think there's two. So we've got this. Oh, look how tiny and delicate this one looks. That is beautiful, Kay. Thank you so, so much for these. And I don't actually have any laces like this. And then this gorgeous one. Thank you so much for these. In the next pocket, she has made two tags. Oh. So we've got kindness and discover. Now I'm thinking that these could be like tuck spots in a journal. I love the flowers on these. And I really like this stamp that she's used in the background. And this one. Oh, look at that little stamp. It's a penny for bacon. I love that. Thank you. Or an apron. And then we've got a tag for me to decorate. And then we've also got a row of pockets along the top here. Look at those butterflies. They're so cute. I do like those butterflies. They're really, really nice. They'll make a really nice birthday card. She's gifted me these... <sighs> with love. And it's a little white dove they're beautiful little Christmas tags because they've got the holly on it thank you <sighs> another Christmas one <laughs> love Christmas so this one is a beautiful stocking love the glitter on it I love the colour of this stocking as well thank you and this one we've got, oh look at those dragonflies. I'm not sure if that's coming up but they are really really glittery. The sparkle on them you can, is really nice. I don't think it's showing up on my camera though properly. I hope it is. But they are beautiful. And... some orange tassels these will be perfect for Halloween for projects making Halloween thank you so much for this Kay I absolutely love your folder thank you I can't believe how much you managed to squeeze into this folder all these beautiful paper clips 
Thank you. So and the last thing is is she's made something up for me to make. intrigued here so we've got this looks like a box with a box base And a card. I've got some mats here for the card. And some beautiful embellishments. Oh, look at that. That is so delicate. another one as well and then we've got this beautiful twirly I'll just use the bag look how delicate that is wow okay thank you so much these are gorgeous <laughs> look how small that one is it's so delicate and dainty it's lovely. Thank you, Kay. This is amazing. I love this little set. And she's even got leaves. Some little flowers as well. And then... I've got these sort of hinge looking things. Oh. That's the card. And then some, a little tag. And then little labels. Two black labels to go with the set. Thank you so much for this set, Kay. I'll have a play around with this later on. Thank you. So, thank you so much for being my swap partner. Um, I absolutely love your swap. <laughs> it's... I'm going to be studying some of these and trying to see how you've done these. Maybe have a go at, at them myself. Love this one. I would love to know how to do this one. And I'm absolutely in love with these tags and these little... I mean, I love this. <laughs> it look, just looks so much fun, so it does. So thank you so much for the inspirational pieces and thank you for the ephemera folder. Um, I hope you liked mine. Please, please go over and check out Kay's channel if you're not already subscribed. She's Kazikins1 here on YouTube. I will link her down in the description box below. Please give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment down below and I will see you all again soon. Thank you again, Kay, and thank you so much for watching. Bye for now.